Hello, sports fans. It's me, Sportsman Z. And I'm here today with the next round in my round robin tournament. And to start it off, we are going to have the 83 Angels going up against the 89 Kansas City Royals. Meanwhile, the 88 A's sit this round out and they will take on the winner of this series. Now, the 83 Angels have defied the odds to get here. They beat the, I want to say 1950-something Indians, maybe the 1954 Indians, and the 2018 Astros. Although you can go back and check that out on my tournament update video but anyway the bottom line is that the Angels are here having been underdogs in both series that they've won the 89 Royals have been a favorite though in the tournament and they are here legitimately but it would be interesting wouldn't it to see the 83 Angels knock them off and then see if they could beat the 88 A's now we'll see if that can happen but we have to play it out to see what happens there. Today's pitchers for the Royals will be um, Mark Gubiza, who was 15 and 11 with a 304 earned run average in 1989. And for the 83 Angels, it will be Mike Witt, who was 7 and 14 with a 491. And the Angels will step into the box to face Gubiza, starting with Juan Benitez, who is the right fielder. And he gets a 5-4, which is a ground ball to the third baseman. And the third baseman is, uh, today, is um, Kevin Seitzer, and he's a 4, and that is an 8. And I have to get the chart out to see what happens on that. It seems like it's going to be something big. Um, eight and four is... No, it's an out. So there's one away. And that brings up Bobby Gritch. Bobby Gritch gets a ground ball to the third baseman and he's out. Two down for the Angels, and Rod Carew comes up, and he gets a 310, which is a single. So that's the first hit of the day for the Angels by Rod Carew. And that brings up Reggie Jackson, who gets a 6-3, which is a ground ball to the first baseman. The first baseman today is George Bratton. He's a 3, and that's a 15. Let's see what that is. That is an error. So, George Brett makes an error, and the Angels have two aboard. Oh, all right. Ah, dang, I messed it up again, but I can't go back. Hopefully, there'll be an error for uh, someone there. But strikeout for Fred Lynn, and he is out. Gubaza with his first K, and no runs come in for California. And I have to remember not to put a hit on the board the next time the Angels get a hit because I erroneously recorded that. The Royals do have an error. The Angels don't, but it's up there right now. So anyway, they got the Angels got no runs there. We go to the bottom of the first. Willie Wilson's up. He gets a 5-6, which is a double one to seven. And that's going to be a single. Willie Wilson's aboard, and he's an A stealer, so you would have to think that they're going to try to steal with him, and they are. And he gets a 9, he is definitely in there. Kevin Seitzer's up, he gets a 2-9, which is a fly, a fly to center, one away. George Brett's up, he gets a 4-8 which is a home run one to nine or a double. And that'll be a double and not get a run.
So, Wit gives up his first uh, hit. No, that's his second hit. Second hit allowed. Right? I think, yeah. And an earned run. And they get a run. And now Brett's at second. Bo Jackson's up. He gets a 6-6, six, six, which is a ground ball to the second baseman. That's Gritch. He's a 2. That is a 10. And that is an out. So that's 2 away. With Bo going down. And Jim Eisenreich up. And he gets a 3-3, three, three, which is a strikeout. First strikeout of the day for Witt and the uh, Royals get a run. In the bottom of the first, we go to the top of the second. DeSensei stepping in. He gets a 3-6, which is a fly ball. Downing comes up. He gets a 4-4, four, four, which is a catcher card. And the catcher, also, I want to point out, is McFarlane. Is uh, Mike McFarlane, who is a catcher 4, and that's an 18. 18 and 4, but I, and that's a foul out. I wanted to point out that McFarlane is the catcher because the other catcher for the 89 Royals is Bob Boone, but Bob Boone is also on the 83 Angels, and I have decided he will, and here he is batting right now, and I decided that he will be the catcher for the Angels in this series, and he pops out to second base. So they get no runs in the second, and we go to the bottom of the second. Danny Tartable is up against Witt. He gets a 1-8, which is a home run. Tartable going deep. So that's going to be another hit. And another run. McFarlane is up. He gets a 3-3, which is a ground ball third. He's out. Frank White steps in. He gets a 6-5, which is a fly ball to center field. Two away. And that brings up Kurt Stillwell, who gets a 2-6, which is a fly ball to right field. But the uh, Royals do score another run, and they make it 2-0 as we go to the top of the third. Tim Foley at the plate. He gets a 4-2, which is a ground ball to the second baseman. And that's Frank White, who is a 2. And that is an out. So Tim Foley is retired. Baniquez is up. He gets a 5-9. That's a fly ball to center. That's two away. And Bobby Gritch comes up. He gets a 3-7, which is a strikeout. So Gubaza gets them 1-2-3 in the third. We go to the bottom of the third. With the score, 2-0. Uh, 2 nothing Royals. Willie Wilson up. He gets a 1-6, which is a ground ball to short, so he's out. Kevin Seitzer's up. He gets a 3-9, which is a strikeout. And George Brett gets a 2-4, which is a line out to second base. So it's not like Witt is pitching poorly, really. It's only 2-0. And one of the runs was on, you know, a home run. He just, uh, the pitch was in the wrong location. So we go to the top of the fourth. Rod Carew up, and he gets a 1-8, which is a single 1-12. to 12. And that is going to be a single. 
So Rod Carew gets his second hit of the game. And we're recording that. Yeah. Jackson is a 1-6, which is fly ball right field. One away. Fred Lynn comes up. He gets a 1-7. That's a ground ball to the first baseman, B. That's two away. And now Fred Lynn is at first. And Doug DeSensei is up. And he gets a 2-5, which is a single one to three. And he will actually line out to second base. And DeSensei is gone. And they get, again, no runs in the fourth. And we go to the bottom of the fourth inning. Two nothing Royals. Bo Jackson's up. He gets a four five, which is a single. Jackson ripping a hit. And we'll get that for the Royals. Eisenreich's up. He gets a 2-6, which is a ground ball B. So now Eisenreich is at first base on the fielder's choice. Tartable's up. He gets a 6-11, which is a fly ball left field. The left fielder for the Angels is Downing, and he's a 3. That's a 17, probably an out, and it is. It's an out 1, though. So the runner advances to second. And McFarland's up and he gets a 4-9, which is a fly ball right field. And no runs come in for the Royals in the fourth. We go to the top of the fifth. It's only 2-0. Close game still at the moment. Brian Downing up. He gets a 4-6, which is a strikeout. One away. Gubaza with his second strikeout. Bob Boone is up. He gets a 4-8, which is a ground ball second baseman. That's Frank White. He's a 2. That's an out. And Tim Foley's up, and he gets a 5-10, which is a fly ball to center. That's Willie Wilson, who is a 2, and that is an out. So the Angels, again, not doing a lot of damage. In fact, what little damage is done, and it's not really because it hasn't resulted in runs, has been done by Rod Carew with two hits. Frank White is up for the Royals in the bottom of the fifth. That's a 6-5, which is a fly to center, one away. Kurt Stillwell gets a 6-6, six, six, which is a ground ball to the second baseman. That's Gritch, and he's a 2. 9 and 2 at second is likely an out, and it is. And up steps Willie Wilson, and he gets a 4-8, which is... A home run, one to nine. And it's actually going to be a double. So Willie Wilson with a hit. Fifth hit for the Royals. And it's a double. And he has two hits today. He's two for three. Sights are up and he gets a six, seven, which is a single one to two. And that is actually going to be a line out to short for Seitzer. No runs for the Royals. We go to the top of the sixth. It's a pretty blank column up there for the uh, for the Angels. Benitez is up, and that's a two-two, which is a walk. So Benitez is the third man to reach base today against Gubaza. Bobby Gritch up. He gets a 6-4. And that's a walk. So Gubaza now all of a sudden has a little bit of a lack of control going on. 
third walk for Goober's Eye. And that brings up Carew, who gets a ground ball double play to third base. Runner goes to third. There's two down, though. And Carew, the guy that was going to be their savior, at least based so far, Reggie Jackson comes up, and he gets a 6-3. And that is a ground ball to first base. George Brett is there. That's a 10. 10-3 ten at first is an out. So Jackson is out. No runs come in for the Angels. And we go to the bottom of the sixth. With George Brett, the one that we were just talking about. He's up at the plate. He gets a 2-2, which is a foul out to the catcher one away. Bo Jackson, Bo knows, and he knows he's flying out to the right fielder, so he's out. And Eisenreich is up, and he gets a 2-7, which is a ground ball to third. No runs in for Kansas City in the sixth. It's still a very close game. It wouldn't, I wouldn't be a bit surprised to see Kansas, or, uh, Kansas City manhandle the Angels all the way till really late in the game and then see the Angels come back. But let's see if that happens. Fred Lynn is up at the plate right now, and he gets a 2-6, which is a fly to right field. I mean, isn't that how it always happens when you're playing Stratomatic? Doug DeSense is up. He gets a 5-9, which is a fly to center. That's two away. And Brian Downing is up, and he gets a 6-5, which is a fly ball to left field. So the Angels lineup has really been hamstrung by uh, Gubiza. Not that you wouldn't have expected that to happen. They've only got two hits and no runs so far. Danny Tartable's up. He gets a 5-8, which is a strikeout. And it's really wasting a really good effort by Mike Witt, if this is relatively how it ends. 3-7 is a strikeout by McFarlane. That's the fourth strikeout for Witt. And White is up, and he gets a 3-5, which is a ground ball to short. No runs come in for the Royals there in the seventh. We go to the eighth. Now it is getting late. Very late. For the Royals or for the uh, Angels. Bob Boone up at the plate. He gets a 2 4, which is a ground ball to the pitcher. So he's out. Foley is up. He gets a 3 11, which is a ground ball to second base. Two down. And Benica is at the plate. He gets a 3 5, which is a strikeout. Only the third strikeout for Gubaza. Maybe more. Maybe I'm missing it. But we go to the bottom of the eighth. Stillwell is at the plate. He gets a 2 4, which is a single. That's the sixth hit. For the Royals, Willie Wilson's up. He gets a 2-4, which is a ground ball double play. So there's two down. Wilson hitting into a double play. And Sites are up at the plate. 3-6 is a ground ball third base. No runs. We go to the top of the ninth. So here it is. This is what it all comes down to. Can the Angels get at least two runs? And that's 5-2, fly ball right field. The right fielder is Bo Jackson, I believe, and he is a 1. And I believe that is also going to be an out. No, it's Eisenreich. He's a 2, but I think that's still an out. Pretty sure that's still an out. And it is. So Gritch is retired. That brings up Rod Carew. He gets a 1-3, which is a ground ball first base. And 
And that brings up Reggie. Reggie Jackson. And he gets a 6-8. And that's a single. So Reggie Jackson keeps them alive. With only the Angels third hit. And let's catch this up. Freddie Lynn. Freddie Lynn gets a 1-7, and that's going to be a ground ball to first base, and that is the game. And the Angels have lost game one of this best of five series. Again, the second round is also, or the third round is also best of five. So the, Ang the, uh, the Royals win this first game by the score, the slimmest of scores, two to nothing. And they will take a one game to nothing lead into game two. You don't want to miss it because this was a good one.